Are you or someone you love living with diabetes? If so, you probably already know how important it is to make smart choices when it comes to what you eat, especially with fruits. Fruits are usually seen as healthy, and for the most part, they are. But for people with diabetes, certain fruits can cause spikes in blood sugar that you want to avoid. Today, we're going to talk about 9 fruits you should definitely be eating if you have diabetes, and 8 fruits you might want to think twice about. Stick around, because this could change the way you look at your fruit bowl. Let's jump right into the good news. There are plenty of fruits that are not only safe for diabetics, but can actually help manage blood sugar levels. The key is choosing fruits with a low glycemic index, which means they have a slower effect on your blood sugar. These fruits provide vitamins, fiber, and antioxidants while keeping your glucose in check. Sounds like a win-win, right? First up on the list of fruits you should be eating is berries. Strawberries, blueberries, raspberries, blackberries, you name it. These little gems are loaded with antioxidants, vitamins, and fiber, but they won't cause a big blood sugar spike. In fact, studies have shown that the antioxidants in berries may even help your body process glucose better. Plus, they're incredibly versatile. You can toss them in a smoothie, sprinkle them on yogurt, or just enjoy them as a quick snack. Next on the list is apples. Yes, an apple a day really might help keep the doctor away. Apples are low on the glycemic index and are packed with fiber, particularly in the skin. The fiber helps slow down the absorption of sugar, which is great for managing your blood glucose. If you're craving something sweet, a sliced apple with a little peanut butter can make a satisfying and blood sugar friendly snack. Moving on, we have oranges. You might think oranges are too sugary, but they're actually a great choice for diabetics when eaten whole. Oranges have a low glycemic index, and like apples, they're full of fiber, especially in the pulp. So, opt for the whole fruit rather than orange juice, which lacks the fiber and has a much higher GI. Let's talk about pears. Pears are another fantastic option. They're rich in fiber and have a low glycemic index, making them a smart choice for those managing diabetes. Plus, they're delicious whether eaten fresh or baked with a sprinkle of cinnamon for a tasty dessert. Cherries are another fruit to consider adding to your diet. They have a surprisingly low glycemic index, and they're packed with antioxidants that may help reduce inflammation, which is important for diabetics who are at higher risk for heart disease. Just be mindful to avoid the sugary processed versions like maraschino cherries. Stick to fresh or frozen cherries. Now, let's talk about kiwi. This fuzzy little fruit might not be on your radar, but it should be. Kiwi is a low GI fruit that's high in vitamin C, potassium, and fiber. These nutrients are great for your overall health and can help regulate blood sugar. And here's a bonus. Kiwi is known to help improve digestion, which can also be beneficial for blood sugar control. Avocados are technically a fruit, and they're amazing for anyone, especially if you're managing diabetes. They're low in carbs, but high in healthy fats and fiber, which means they won't spike your blood sugar. In fact, the healthy fats in avocados can actually help improve insulin sensitivity, which is crucial for keeping diabetes in check. 
Add them to salads, sandwiches, or even smoothies for a creamy, satisfying boost. Peaches might seem like an indulgence, but they're actually a good fruit for diabetics when eaten fresh. Peaches have a low to moderate glycemic index and are full of vitamins and antioxidants. Pair them with a handful of nuts for a balanced, blood sugar-friendly snack. Lastly, let's not forget about grapefruit. Like oranges, grapefruit has a low glycemic index and it's packed with fiber and vitamin C. Grapefruit may even help with weight management, which is important for people with diabetes. Just be careful if you're on certain medications, as grapefruit can interact with them. Always check with your doctor if you're unsure. Now that we've covered the fruits that are great for diabetics, let's switch gears and talk about the ones you should probably avoid, or at least limit. These fruits tend to have a high glycemic index or are loaded with natural sugars that can cause your blood sugar to spike. First up, bananas. Bananas are full of potassium and other nutrients, but they're also high in carbohydrates and have a medium to high glycemic index, depending on how ripe they are. The riper the banana, the higher the sugar content, which can cause your blood sugar to rise quickly. If you really love bananas, try sticking to smaller, less ripe ones, or eat them with a protein or fat source like peanut butter to slow down the sugar absorption. Another fruit to watch out for is mango. As delicious as mangoes are, they're also very high in natural sugars, which can lead to blood sugar spikes. While it's okay to enjoy a small portion now and then, mangoes should definitely be on your eat in moderation list if you're managing diabetes. Let's talk about pineapple. Pineapple is loaded with vitamin C and other good stuff, but it also has a high glycemic index and a lot of natural sugars. Even though it's refreshing and tropical, it's best to limit your intake if you're trying to keep your blood sugar steady. If you do indulge, try to pair it with a protein like Greek yogurt to balance things out. Watermelon might be a summertime favorite, but it's not the best choice for diabetics. Watermelon has a very high glycemic index, meaning it can spike your blood sugar quickly. While it's hydrating and full of vitamins, it's one of those fruits you should only eat in small amounts. Next up is grapes. Grapes are small, sweet, and easy to snack on, but they're also high in natural sugars. Even though they're packed with antioxidants, the high sugar content can be a problem for diabetics. It's better to have just a few grapes at a time rather than eating them by the handful. You might also want to avoid dates. Dates are often considered a healthy sweetener, but they're extremely high in sugar. Just a few dates can contain as much sugar as a candy bar. If you're managing diabetes, dates are probably best avoided, or at least kept to a very small portion size. Figs are another fruit that's best enjoyed in moderation if you're diabetic. Figs are high in fiber, which is great, but they're also high in sugar. Dried figs, in particular, are very concentrated in sugar, so they can cause a big spike in blood glucose. And finally, we have raisins. Like figs and dates, raisins are a dried fruit, which means the sugars are highly concentrated. Just a small handful of raisins can send your blood sugar soaring. If you're craving something sweet and chewy, it's better to stick with fresh berries or an apple. 
So there you have it. Nine fruits that can be your friend when managing diabetes, and eight that you should be a bit more cautious with. It's all about balance and making informed choices. The good news is, you don't have to give up fruit entirely, even with diabetes. By focusing on low glycemic index fruits and watching portion sizes, you can still enjoy the natural sweetness that fruit has to offer without wreaking havoc on your blood sugar levels. If you found this information helpful, make sure to like this video and subscribe for more tips on living a healthier, happier life. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Thanks for watching.